Hi, welcome at the Mod booth at Sonar Barcelona. Uh, my name is Jesse, I'm the audio specialist for Mod Devices. Um, and today I'll be telling you a bit about what our product, the Mod Duo, can do. Uh, and also giving you some bit of uh, sound samples to show you what it sounds like. Our device over here is basically a computer in a box. Um, and it runs virtual plugins. So it's not a VST, but it's an LV2, which is uh, the Linux equivalent of a VST or an AU plugin. Uh, and we also have Max support. So plugins that are written in Max Gen, you can simply press a button, it exports it, installs it on the device. So you can actually take your own creations to the stage. Uh, it's built in Germany, it's built like a tank. And the most exciting part to me personally is that you can create amazing effects chains that you can't build on other devices at all. Uh, so we have independent inputs and outputs, so you could actually run two different devices in here. Uh, example of that would be some of the bands that are using it with, for example, a bass guitar in input one, but then the kick drum mic in input two. So you could actually have uh, a real bass guitar sidechained by a real kick drum. Uh, we have regular DIN MIDI inputs, we also have USB MIDI, and you can even put in a USB hub to connect multiple USB MIDI controllers. Uh, we have more I.O., so for example, we also have a control chain port, which is our uh, own protocol, but it's open source, so people can contribute to it. Uh, and it allows you to add some more uh, in-depth controllers. So for example, adding some foot switches, in which you can actually see what every switch does on the display, uh, as opposed to most MIDI foot switches. So just to give an example of the things that you can do, um, is you can actually split connections into multiple ones. You can also merge connections together, and you can even create feedback loops. Um, and this flexibility allows you to create all these wacky sounds, uh, especially the feedback loops are a personal favorite of mine. Uh, yeah, it would be awesome if I could give you some sound samples. So those were just some examples uh, of the sounds that you could make. Um, but of course, it's, it's very much up to the creativity of the user. Uh, you have infinite possibilities, literally. It's just a sandbox for creative exploration and creating new sounds that you've never heard before.